the idea is to transform 260 years of document that Vacheron Constantin have into an information system. When we met with the people of EPFL Ical Lab, we realized that our 260 years old heritage could also have a value in terms of research. The scanning process produces images. First, we need to transcribe them. Then, when you have this text, we try to identify special things like people, places, uh, important objects, and create a network out of each document. Among these archives, you can find hundreds of registers, over 8 million of pages of correspondence through all our history. But then there is a second step, is how you can give a new meaning to this archive by really bringing the people into this fantastic world of history. The main challenge of the experience with the Chronogram project was to offer to the users a maximum of freedom. And it was a big challenge to offer to the user the ability to choose and to discover all the papers they want. And that the people almost forget the device, that they have an emotional relation with this new world that we can present through the digital means, and they really forget the technical side of it. When you have an archive as rich as the one that Vacheron Constantin have, you can actually exploit it to be capable of extracting information, exploiting another way, and using all the information you have in the past to reinvent a future.